On March 31st, Clayton Industries demonstrated the safety of the Clayton steam generator with a destructive test of a model EG-504 500 boiler horsepower unit. This test was witnessed by two inspectors from the Technical Standards and Safety Authority, the Boiler Safety Organization for the province of Ontario, Canada. The destructive test was created by reducing the feed water flow to the unit, which resulted in a low water condition. Clayton uses three safety devices to protect the unit from failure in this situation. There are two coiled temperature monitoring thermocouples and a steam temperature switch located in the steam separator. In normal situations, these safeties cause an alarm and shut down in the event that the pre-established temperature limits are reached. In this case, these devices were removed from the unit and thus allowed the burner to continue to fire uninterrupted. What you will see in the next few minutes is the full destruction of the steam generator pressure vessel without any danger from a steam explosion. Traditional boilers occasionally rupture, and the resultant release of energy from the pressure vessel can be deadly. By design, the Clayton monotube coil cannot have a catastrophic steam explosion. At this point, the first coil thermocouple shutdown point has been surpassed. second shutdown point has now been passed. The steam temperature set point now has also been passed. The remaining water is not sufficient to avoid destruction of the coil. The burner has now ruptured the coil. As you see, there is no steam explosion. A complete meltdown of the coil is now occurring. The burner control flame sensor is the only active safety device which ultimately safely terminates the fuel flow and stops the unit firing. This is the unit after it was disconnected from its fuel supply and allowed to cool. You can now see the dramatic amount of destruction that occurred without a danger to plant, property, or personnel to a steam explosion. The Clayton steam generator is the industry leader in quality, efficiency, and safety.